I wonder if he's poisonous. He looks very uh, intimidating. Command, and this is Ron and Lilo. We've been living full time in this truck camper for two years. In my 50s, I decided to stop existing and start living my dreams. I left my life and career to become a nomad and travel. If you like our videos, please subscribe, like, and comment. We'd be so grateful. Good morning. Today is moving day. We've been at a campground for a couple of weeks, but today we're packing up and moving. If you are here to only see me load the truck camper, please skip to frame number 838 or the truck camper loading chapter. But first, we're gonna go for a dog walk. I love this campground because there's so much natural beauty around and the trails are gorgeous and there's miles of them and there's a state park right next door. I love the sound of birds. It fills my heart. Thank you birds for serenading me. Happy place. I have <laughs> I have a sweat mustache. It's warm and it's only like 8 a.m. That's Florida. Sweat mustache. Sweaty armpits. Sweaty everything. There's some rain clouds forming. I have to get back. I don't like loading the camper in the rain. It sucks. Post walk treat. Love you guys. Oh no, it's starting to rain. I hate packing up in the rain. And it's like 10.20 and I'm supposed to be out of here by 11. So, <sighs> let me get going. Good morning. Good morning. Um, I currently have nobody coming in here, so take your time. Oh. There's the 11, 11, 12, I, it's, it's either way. Oh, great. If you, just, if you got something to do, because no one's coming in. Okay. And if they do, we'll put them somewhere else. I'm currently using a moon shade as my rear awning. The factory awning was ripped off in high winds in El Paso. It was actually comical because I had to crawl under it to get out of my camper. It was going to cost me $2,000 to replace it. The moonshade was only $3.95 and it is lighter and I can angle it to give me better shade. I mounted onto my roof rack with these heavy duty twist ties that I bought for six bucks on Deal Genius. So far it's working out really well, but it is a little precarious climbing up on the roof to unhook them. Giant spider friend on my tent. Oh my god, I wonder if he's poisonous. He looks very uh, intimidating. I don't want him to stay on my tent. You're gonna have to go. You're gonna have to go, little spider. <laughs> what am I gonna do? Oh. Calm 
calm down. It's just a spider. I can figure this out, right? I can figure this out. You gotta go. You gotta go! <laughs> oh no, where did he go? All right, I need two hands for this. The back seat's all loaded. If anyone has any ideas about how to store the Starlink, let me know because what I'm doing is not working. It's like Tetris back there. I need a better solution. Truck's all packed up. Now it's for the camper. dogs in the truck. No, 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 no! <laughs> Ron, I was made to run for it. Run! Uh, moving day makes them very anxious. Sorry, guys. You're being really good, though, buddy. I'm actually in the home stretch. <laughs> I just have to load the camper now onto the truck, which is easier. Now it's time to raise the camper with the hydraulic jack system. So to engage it, Press that, and then I'll use this handy dandy remote.
here I am installing the torque lift camper tie downs. The frame brackets are mounted to the truck frame and there is another bracket that is removable when it is not in use. I didn't realize how rusty they got. I'll have to fix that. Here I am engaging the fast gun truck camper turnbuckles by torque lift. I really put these to the test when my truck and camper were towed and at a 45 degree angle. They worked amazingly well. My truck! <laughs> oh my god! They're kind of scary. I'm all packed up. I did it! Yay! And I'm filthy. It's okay. I have to go dump my tanks and I'm stopping in. I'm stopping in the office to get a coffee. Finally, coffee. And it's one in the afternoon. Before we get on the road, I want to show you how I changed the bedding in my truck camper. It's a mix of yoga, tumbling, and sumo wrestling. I consider this part of my morning workout. I'm trying to avoid bruises, but when you live in a small space, sometimes you bump into things. I have two of these Pup Protector Dog Blankets by Paw.com. It's a waterproof throw blanket and it protects my bed from dog hair, muddy paws, and spills. It allows my bedding to stay clean and it avoids turning my entire bed into a dog bed. Ormond Beach, Florida, and I'm going swimsuit shopping. <laughs>
do pineapple or blueberries on that. Oh. Yeah, what like do you do suggest? I think on the um, bowl you're getting, I think pineapple would be perfect. Okay. Okay. Right. What size would you like? Oh, my house. Is that your mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yummy. Oh my god, I'm at the beach and it's so windy that the camper is like rocking. I wanted to go swimming, but I don't know. Looks like Riptideville out there. But I got this baby. Um When I come visit my parents, this is like one of my favorite places just to park up and look at the scenery and just relax. It's beautiful. Yeah. Look at that view from my bedroom window. Wow. Does it get any better than that? Thank you for watching. We appreciate you so much. Always be kind, especially to yourself. And we'll see you on the next one.